Welcome back to Ann's Boxing Channel. My people, I got some breaking news for y'all, right? Subriel Matias versus Liam Paro is in discussions. They're in talks. They're negotiating to fight. Massive. Huge fight. I love it. Great fight. Subriel Matias goes without explanation. The Puerto Rican Mamba. The Puerto Rican Mamba. I don't want to say this in any type of way, but we already know. He killed a man in the ring. Subriel Matias caught a body in the ring. And that's not to, to, um, to glorify nothing like that because that is sad. That's terrible. But it's to speak on how dangerous that guy is. If you know anything about Subriel Matias, his mentality, the things that the guy has been through, Subriel Matias, he's honestly an animal. He's a caged beast. He's an animal. He's not, he's not your regular person. He's not your regular person. He's an animal, and he's a dangerous guy to fight. His last fight, he took punishment, punishment, big shots from a power-punching machine. And the way he endured it and dished it back, Subriel Matias is somebody that I wouldn't want to fight for the life of me. You know what I mean? Liam Paro got guts for getting in the ring with Subriel Matias. I clap it up for him. Now, Liam Pavro was coming off of defeating two undefeated fighters and knocking out Montana Love. He knocked out Montana Love in six, right? So Liam Pavro has proven himself that he himself is a force to be reckoned with. Now, this is a step-up fight because he hasn't faced anybody like Subriel Matias. He just hasn't. My initial feelings on it, I favor Subriel Matias. I think he's just too much of a dog. I think he's the bigger guy. And I think he's just, he's too vicious, man. To beat Subriel Matias is going to take somebody who has power. You need power. And you need to have the some, some superior boxing ability to beat Subriel Matias. At 140, who could be Subriel Matias, to be honest with you? I think Teofimo has a chance because Subriel Matias comes forward so much and that plays into Teofimo's game plan. That's the type of fighter that Teofimo excels against. But the thing about Subriel Matias is that relentless pressure that he also puts on you. Teofimo isn't good fighting backwards. See, Teofimo is good if you're standing in front of him. But Subriel Matias will put Teofimo on his back foot. And when he puts Teofimo on his back foot and Teofimo can't counter and leverage his power the way he's used to when he's just plotted, Subriel Matias can really do some damage to Teofimo. I don't know who... I, I would slightly favor um, Subriel Matias in that fight, but this isn't about that anyways. Um, Devin Haney, I don't think he'd be Subriel Matias either. I think he cannot box him and look flashy for a little bit. But Subriel Matias eventually is going to get that body. Subriel Matias is eventually going to corner Devin Haney. He's eventually going to land some bombs, and I think he'll break him down. I don't see who could really beat Subriel Matias right now at 140, to be honest with you. But Liam Pavro is to be respected for taking this fight, especially coming off a fight like Montana Love, because he could have fought somebody to just stay busy. But he's going to fight the monster, the Puerto Rican monster. David Benavidez is the Mexican monster. Subriel Matias is the Puerto Rican monster. If anybody out there doesn't know who Subriel Matias is, if you like David Benavidez, if you know David Benavidez, go look up Subriel Matias. He's the Puerto Rican monster. He's the Puerto Rican David Benavidez. Now, this fight um is going to be very, it will be very interesting. I don't it's not official yet, but it's just being negotiated, but I would love if it happened because this fight would be great for Subriel Matias. It would definitely help him cuz now he would he would have a fight with a guy who beat Montana Love, who is a credible a very credible fighter, very credible boxer, <clears throat> very skilled and you know, was respected in the boxing game. And Liam Pavro stopped him in 6. So if Subriel Matias can do what Subriel Matias does against Liam Pavro, and Liam Pavro did what he did against Montana Love, that's a great look for Subriel Matias. Um, of course, you know what I mean? I'm supporting Subriel Matias in this. You, know, I, you already know. I've showed y'all before. Like, you know what I mean? You, you, you see it. You feel me? Puerto Rican, baby. That's what it is. So I got to support my own. But 
you know, I support both fighters at the end of the day. You know what I mean? They're getting in there. They're risking it. They're putting it on the line. Um, I, I support Liam um, Liam Pavel too, and I respect him. Tip my hat to him. Respect. Salute for taking a dangerous fight with somebody like that because nobody's rushing to fight Subriel Matias. You know what I mean? So you coming off of that fight to fight him, you could have caught out a Regis Pro Gray or somebody else. Like, even though Regis looking like he's doing some MMA stuff, I don't know. But the point is, he has options. He could have caught out somebody else. But he's going for Subriel Matias. That's to be respected. I feel Subriel Matias will win this fight. But nevertheless, guys, we got to respect these guys that take these risks. Because taking these risks is what gives us the fights that we want. And taking these risks is what, is what gives us the entertainment that we love. The sport of boxing. You get what I'm saying? So put some respect on their names. But um, that's what I wanted to share with y'all guys. Um, What's his name? Subria Matias with Liam Pavro is in talks. It's in negotiations. Hopefully everything goes through well and we get that fight. Because I want to see Subriel Matias back in the ring ASAP. The Puerto Rican monster. If you haven't heard of him, if you don't know him, look him up. Subriel Matias. Do your homework. Beast. But that's it, fans. Boxing channel. Like, comment, subscribe if y'all like the content so y'all can catch more coming soon. Because it will be coming soon. But I'm out. I love y'all. Peace and blessings. That's it, fans. Boxing channel. I'm out.